Good day Aries and welcome to my channel. I'm Misha the Psychotic Psychedelic Gypsy and this is your weekly reading for July 24th to the 30th. If you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. And as always, I hope you're all doing well and I hope this reading resonates with you. The Joker. Queen of Spades, the Three of Spades, and the Ace of Clubs. Okay. All right. Well, this week you need to take action. Uh, if you have a love interest or you have some kind of idea for a project or something like that, or anything, any kind of idea. Uh, the cards say that it's time to take action. That's the only way that it's going to work is if you take action. Uh, I mean, that's pretty much how it goes for everything. But it seems like you might be stagnant on going with this idea or this love interest. And the cards say not to, that you need to take action. Uh, that it will all work out and it will lead you to new change in life, a new, a new way of life. So definitely, if you have uh, a love interest or you have some kind of idea that you're wanting to do, um, definitely take action on that. At the beginning of the week, uh, it looks like uh, you are heading towards something. I, I'm thinking it's this ideal or this love. You're heading towards something new. Uh, it's a positive risk. And uh, your past might be trying to hold you back, but what you have in front of you is something new. Uh, see, change new by taking action. Uh, you have something new, something that's going to bring innocence to your heart and mind and uh you need to go for it because this is this is a really good change uh but beware your past is probably trying to hold you back the weight here is the 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 weight of your past trying to hold you back and you need to not look backwards you need to look forwards uh the sun is is lighting your way forward you need to take that leap take that uh chance that risk uh just make sure that you plan and prepare uh, as you're going towards it, but again, take that risk, take the leap, take that action on whatever it is that you're looking for. It can be an idea, it can be love, it can be both, it can be moving, it can be anything, uh, really. Uh, so there is something definitely ahead of you that is going to change your life. Your past is going to be left behind during this, and some people might be trying to hold you back, which here you are looking back on your past, and here is... Uh, a warning of an instigator, somebody that's resentful of you, that wants to put a monkey wrench in your in your plans. Uh, that might be the past that's holding you back from this possible risk that you need to take. Um, you need to all you need to know everything there is to know about this person. Know all the facts. Uh, why they're they're you know uh, resentful towards you. Why they're trying to put a monkey wrench in your plans. I mean, if it's somebody from your past, they might just feel that, you know, they're being left behind and you might just need to reassure them. But either way, you have to you have to move away from this past and move forward into this future and take action on this future. This whatever's whatever's in front of you, new job or whatever it may be, uh, you need to go for it. Um, at the end of the week, well, uh, there's going to be miscommunication. And it's going to lead to a fight and a breakup due to betrayal. Um, the cards say that it's time. It's time for this to happen. And I'm thinking that it's this person, this uh, this instigator, some of the person that's resentful towards you. I feel like you're going to have a fight with them. And it's due to some kind of betrayal. They might have tried to do something. Uh, they might try to do something really like uh, betraying, you know, to keep you in the past to keep you where you are instead of going to this future uh and it's going to lead to uh an end uh breakup and here comes the kitty uh let's see here A aries have you guys met poison yet i don't know but that's poison my cat she likes to come and interrupt sometimes anyway so yeah i mean prepare for a breakup I mean, but it's time. It's time for this change. You got change here, change here, positive risk, which is a big change here. This is this is zero, you know. This is the beginning of something completely new. 
So this past, whoever this is or whoever they are, it could be more than one, you need to leave it. Just leave it in the past. You have bigger and better things coming to you in the future. So look ahead. Don't look back. Look ahead. Take action. Take the risk. Take the leap. Uh, but plan and prepare. But this is going to be a good thing for you. So and prepare for a breakup. That's just how it goes sometimes. Uh, let's see what the tarot cards have to say about this. I mean, there's not much else to really say. But we'll see. Universe speak. Spirit's guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? And that card is the Nine of Swords. So right now you might you know during this time you might feel like worried that you're going to be alone and it might be causing you nightmares and whatnot and that could be this instigator causing you to have that worry uh, about being alone and being afraid of this future that you're heading towards um it's it, i mean it's going to be a big change because so that's going to bring on anxiety and that's going to bring on you know bad dreams nightmares uh, worried feelings it's going to bring on that stuff you know almost every time we go into something new especially this new because this is new new this is like starting from zero you know and when we do that that causes a lot of anxiety and stuff but you need to just go keep pushing forward towards it and not giving up uh, this is not a time for you to give up because you are coming so close to something new in your life that's going to be really good. So don't let this instigator cause you to worry so much that you don't go ahead and, and leap forward into your future. Well, I hope this resonated. If it did, hit that like button. And if you would, please comment, share, and subscribe. I hope to see you back here next week. And until then, stay safe, stay mindful, and stay healthy.